Today I'm going to steam juice some pears. I'm going to try to get some juice. I have about uh, 15 pounds of pears here, and about seven kilos. And I have my Finnish steam juicer. I've got one cup of sugar or 250 milliliters. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to steam this to see how much juice I get. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to fill the bottom pan up with water very close to the top. There we go. That's about six liters of water or six quarts. And I'm going to make sure my hose goes into my receptacle. I like to have my steam juicer above my receptacle. That way gravity does the work and it doesn't get backed up. Uh, so now I'm going to load this. I think it's all going to fit. And you don't want to overload it because you need that lid to be on. Otherwise, the steam won't interact with the fruit and cause it to juice. Oh. Dropped a couple. Now that I loaded my hopper, I'm going to pour a cup of sugar over top. The sugar is optional. Uh, it really helps to macerate the fruit and extract more juice. But if you don't want a lot of sugar in there, if you want low sugar, or if you think it's going to alter the taste of what you're doing, then just omit the sugar. It doesn't make a big difference. I'm going to put the lid back on and then I'm going to fire it up. So there we have it, about 15 pounds of pears yielded just under four liters or four quarts of pear juice. Not bad, a little less of a yield than we would get if we were doing say um, cherries or gooseberries, which we've also done in the past. If you're interested in our other steam juicing videos, those will be on our channel as well. But highly recommend the Finnish steam juicer for ease of use and yield when it comes to juicing fruit.